Hi folks, welcome to my shop, aka our dining room. Alright, I've already done a video about this one, but after I did after I did the video on this one, somebody gave us this one. It's an actual Power Wheels. Uh, that's in like an off-brand Power Wheels, but this is an actual Power Wheels uh, four-wheeler. And it was six volt, and it's got an actual drive shaft. Both wheels will turn at the same time, which I thought was really cool. But it's only got one motor, and it's slow. It is very, very slow. Had Damon out there, my son, and he pushed the gas, and it was just... Yeah, it wasn't going nowhere. So, I had a couple extra batteries. And so here's what I did. It was very simple. I upped it to 18 volts. It's probably going to blow this motor, but I don't care about it because I'm, if you pan over there, I'm thinking about taking the motors out of that Jeep and putting it in there. Which would be freaking cool, I think. And don't worry about that. That will have an extra life. But I'm thinking about putting actually 50cc. I'm, I'm not going to explain it. It's going to be for a future project. Anyways, but I, what I did was I had an extra couple extra batteries. And that one just hooked in there. And then I had no other room. If you see right there, I just marked up a battery. It was kind of flat. That's a 6 volt. Put some wire around there. Put it through there, wrapped it around, twisted it, tied it in a knot, whatever. Dirty. This is just a toy. It probably only lasts but two or three months anyway, so. With all three batteries, that's 6 volt, 6 volt, 6 volt, makes it 18 volt. That motor is probably going to blow. But let's run it. Alright, stop. 